Hi all! So sorry I've been behind on my videos lately. Um, back in July we went on a week-long camping trip. We immediately got back and moved. Now I'm sitting in our kind of empty apartment hoping our couch gets delivered today and I figured it was time to finally do some unboxings. So today I think I'm just going to go ahead and unbox my July and my August both my glam bags, my Ipsy Pluses, and my Boxy Charms, and we'll just see which ones are my favorites and go from there. So, let's go ahead and start off with the glam bags. I hope everyone has been having a fabulous summer. I was just going to say fantabulous summer. <laughs> um, ooh, I already see I've got something extra sticking out for me. Cool. Pacifica Bronzed Rose. Rose and Coconut Infused Blush and Bronzer for your beautiful cheeks. Alright. Let's ooh, see if I can get into this here. This is a pretty little box. I really like it. I love that it's rose and coconut infused. That just makes it sound really fancy. Oh, geez. Okay. Hang on. We're having technical difficulties here. Well, okay. Here we go. Oh, Daisy. Okay. So, I feel like I've gotten something from them before, but I can't remember what it was at the moment. But this does look pretty cool. Let's see here. It's really soft. It's got a nice feeling to it. It's got a pretty pink blush. And then the bronzer. I can't really see the bronzer. Sorry, the lighting isn't super great in here. Once we get all settled in, I'll try to find a better place to do my videos. But for now, this is what we've got. Alright, so moving on to the actual bag part. This is a really cute bag. It goes with the summery theme. There's some leaves on there. I think this, I'm pretty sure this was the July bag, which makes sense for that. Alright, let's see here. I'm just going to take everything out, and then we'll look at each product. Okay, so... Before, yes, this was for July. Perfect. They're calling this Dive In. And it said, Summer is in full swing. Let's soak it up with dewy skin, beach babe waves, and shimmering, budge-proof makeup looks. Perfect. Okay. Ooh, okay. I have one other lotion from Hemp's, and I love it. It's the blue one. Um, it's at my work, so I can't go grab it to see what the flavor is. But this one is Sweet Pineapple and Honey Melon. Mmm, smells so good. I really like their lotions a lot, so I'm really excited to give this one a try. And let's see what else I got from them. Laritzi Cosmetics Dew Popped. What is that? <laughs> oh, it's a day for technical difficulties. Or is it just Megan difficulties? It's hard to say. Hmm. Yeah, I honestly don't know what this is, but it's pretty. So <laughs> let's read the little pamphlet and find out. Okay, it's a pink highlighter. I don't know how... Just like a... Oh, okay, never mind. I thought it was saying it was a highlighter for your hair, and I was really confused. But it's a pearl pink highlighter, and it's made with a fine shimmer that enhances every skin tone. Gently dab on the high points of your face. I don't know how you're supposed to know that just from looking at it, but it is really pretty. It's got a very soft, silky, smooth texture. You kind of got to push to really get some on your finger. Oh, and it doesn't go on very pink, so it gives kind of a pretty shimmer. 
you can see that there, not really. <laughs> okay, and then I also got, what's the tea? Ice tea eyeshadow mini. It's infused with hibiscus. Ooh, that's a pretty one. Look at that. I love the Balm Cosmetics packaging. It's so cute. They always have cute little boxes, cute little pictures and sayings. Let's see here. And this looks like a really pretty purple. That's an eyeshadow I might use. I like that a lot. And last thing I got in my July glam bag was this brow brush. And I don't really do a lot with my eyebrows, especially since I started moving back away from the red hair, back towards my blonde. Um, I've just never been one of those people that fills them in like crazy. But this would probably be good to have just in case I ever decide to. I don't currently have anything I can even dip this in. But it does look like a neat little brush, and it's got this, which is always handy, even if you don't fill them in. So overall, it's a cool little brush. And that was it for my July Ipsy Glam Bag. And let's do our August Glam Bag. And then we'll take a quick little break. Ooh. I like the feel of the August glam bag already. It's really, it's got a cool texture. Like it looks like it would be really hard, but then it's the soft, kind of like their bags normally are. But I just like touching it. And it's almost like a dark green. Oh, it is. It's like a forest green. So that's really pretty. I don't think we have any in that color yet. Okay. Our August says, bear yourself. Hmm. All right. August is my birthday month, and so I'm a fan. So I hope I got some good stuff in here. Let's see. First up, a little jelly shot lip quencher. Hmm. Okay, let's read about this. With 24 karat gold specks and a flower set into it, this moisture-rich balm is so pretty. Plus, avocado oil, rice bran oil, and vitamin E work to hydrate and repair dry or cracked lips. Cool. Let's just try this right now. I'm a fan of, like, ooh. Okay, see, I thought this was going to be more like a chapstick. But it's not. It's like a little, like, lipstick. Oh my gosh. Look how cute that is. Can you see that? There is literally a flower down inside of it. It's adorable. I almost don't want to use it. Ooh, it feels good on the lips, kind of tingly. That's really fancy. I like that a lot. All right, let's see what else we got. Ooh. Okay, now we got a mascara from Thrive Cosmetics. It says Liquid Lash Extensions Mascara in Rich Black. So, Daisy's trying to come around the laptop again. Ooh, I like that brush. It's got a good, uh, oh, I'm sweating. It's warm in here. I turned the AC off so it wouldn't be loud. Okay. Next. Ooh, this looks cool. Coco Cabana Cream. It is by Sol, S-O-L. Love it, flaunt it, you got it. I've had something by them before and I really liked it, so I bet this is going to be good too. 
Mm, it smells really good. I love the little container it's in. It's the perfect size. This one is definitely going in my purse. I'm super excited for that. Okay. I think I have two more things in here or just one. Did I already do one, two, three, four? Am I missing something? There's a brush in my bag. Ooh, this is a really pretty brush. Okay. I can't read what it says, but it's something glam, angled eye. Look how pretty that is. It's a nice little brush. It's really fluffy. Um, it doesn't look like it's really like a... It looks more like a shader. It's an angled eye shader, I think. It's not like a detail brush, but it's really pretty. It'll look really cute in my little makeup bob. And my very last product here, it looks like it says it's an eyeshadow. Cat's getting into boxes that are empty. Ooh. Oh my goodness, that is a pretty purple. <laughs> that will go perfect with the purple I got for my July bag. Look at this. Let's see where my other one is. These are going to be perfect together. Oh yeah. I'm excited for that. I don't wear eyeshadow very often, especially not like super bright colors, but I'm really excited to give these a shot. I'm going to go ahead and run, take a quick little break, and then we'll come back and we're going to unpack the rest of these bags. Bye. Okay, I'm back. I had to get a pillow to sit on and put my hair up because, surprise, surprise, these laminate floors are not that comfortable. And as I mentioned, it's super hot in here. Um, so next, I figured we'd go ahead and do our boxy charms. Um, I'm pretty sure this one is my July one because it got a little smushed during the move. So we will start with this one. I'm super excited because I just signed up for Boxy Lux. It says I'm on the wait list, so I don't know if that means that I'm going to get it in September or not. But I'm still really excited. I really hope I get it in September. But if not, December, I guess, will be fun. Um, ooh, okay. So the first thing I'm pulling out of here is a little coupon that they sent me. Um... For something that's already over, it looks like July 7th to August 3rd. So that's what I get for opening the box late. Here's our actual little card. It says, Oh Natural. I like this card. I like just the simple little designs on the sides. That's my kind of thing. Okay. Very first thing I'm going to pull out of here is this because it looks fancy. Luxie. Gaia, Gaia, G-A-E-A, -E I don't know how to say that, but it says, unleash your true beauty by being kind to the earth. Please help keep our planet beautiful by recycling this package. That's cool. Oh, and I, they're brushes. So it's Luxie brushes, large eye blending, precision crease, and foundation. Let's see here. Man, I really like that they're doing that recyclable packaging, and I really like these brushes. I don't know that I would use this one for foundation. It's a little small for me, but it is nice and small for soft, not nice and small. And then we have the large blending and the precision crease. They're really pretty little brushes. I'm really excited to be getting more brushes because I really haven't done a lot with brushes and so the more tools I get, the more I can play with makeup and learn and it's fun. So next, I have, oh, there's a fly in here. Gross. That's what I get for having the door open last night. Um, Elemis, and now it's bothering me. Okay, let's ignore it. Elemis Superfood Vital Veggie Mask. So it's a nourishing prebiotic green mask. Ooh, very cool. I've been needing a new face mask, so that's awesome. You remove it after 10 minutes. Let's see here.
Looks like it even has a little bit of a greenish tinge to it. I'll be really excited to give this a try. Um, now that we're moved into our new place, I have a bathtub again, so I can like do a mask and I can take a bath and I can just do all of the lovely self-care things that I love. Speaking of, cleansing spa water contains natural herbal essences. What? It's a cleansing water cloth. Oh, makeup remover. They know me well. I love makeup remover wipes. Awesome. I'll be super excited to give these a try. This is by Ko Gen Du. Maybe some sort of like Korean um, skincare line or something. Oh, made in Japan. That's really cool. Uh, let's see my last two products in here. Ooh. This is pretty, look how fancy that is. I love it. It's an eyeshadow palette, that's what I thought, and I love those colors too. I am loving the eyeshadows that I'm getting today. This is gonna be so nice. Hmm. Green. I always have a hard time angling towards the camera. I'm not very good at it. You see? So that's the green and that's the blue. They're kind of hard to see. They swatch pretty well though in person. And the lighting is so bad right here, it's hard to see. But they're a really pretty color. They've got a nice shimmer to them. I'll be really excited to give these a try. And then my last thing for my July boxy is this Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick Santorini. This looks like a really bright hot pink and so it's kind of terrifying. Um, I don't know that it's something that I could wear. Though I say that almost every time and then I try them on and then it's not so bad. But this one is particularly bright. So, I'm not going to put it on today, but I'd be really curious, did you get this product, this Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lip? How did you like the color? Alright, let's also do our August Boxy. My hair is falling out. It's getting too long to be put back in the clip, but the summer is still too hot to not have it back. Okay, my August Bopsy Charm. Here we come. Lots of issues getting boxes open today. All right, August Bopsy Charm. Totally. Okay. Very first thing I see in here is a mascara, so let's pull it out and look. It's the Tarte Big Ego. I think this one is vegan, if I remember correctly. Cruelty-free and vegan. So, I've seen this on their website, but I've never used it. I'll be really excited to give this a shot. Twisted Double Fiber Bristles for Max Pigment Load. Lash Loving Ingredients. That's awesome. Confidence. Confident dense booster brush. Okay. Then Wander Beauty Glow Ahead Illuminating Face Oil. Hmm. Bring out skin's inner radiance with our illuminating oil. Light diffusing optics deliver instant luminosity while a potent blend of our signature beauty oils and antioxidants help brighten, moisturize, and improve the appearance of skin over time. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, I saw something about these on, I think it was Facebook, so let's take a look now. Ace Beauty Glimmer Shadow. Those are some intense colors. Huckleberry and French Vanilla. Apparently, July and August were the months for, like, this crazy, intense eyeshadow. 
This is the Huckleberry. It's watched pretty well on my arm. And then this one they're calling French Vanilla. So let's see how this one looks. Let's Those are pretty. I like how it has the little ribbed, it just looks cool. Doesn't really do anything, I don't think, for the eyeshadow, but it looks cool. Alright, I've got two more products down in here. Next one is by Steve Laurent. Looks like it's maybe an eyeliner or an eyebrow. I hate when it doesn't say. But our little deal here should. Lip liner. Aw oh, man, guys, stop sending me lip liners. I don't use them. I think I'm gonna go ahead and not open this one because maybe I can pass it on to a friend. But, I mean, Steve Laurent normally makes decent products. I just do not use lip liners. I'm hard pressed to put on any sort of lip product besides chapstick. And if I do, I'm not put on a lip liner too. Wow, this is fancy. This is by Becca. It's big. Some sort of powder. Hydra Mist Set and Refresh Powder. Ooh, cool. Keep me closed to keep me cool. Ooh, look at that. That is fancy. More people need to come up with this kind of cool packaging. Mm. See it in there? This is a really neat little package. These guys get five stars for packaging. Ooh, I just almost dumped it everywhere. Look at that. Well, I'm really excited to use this. It looks like it's just like a refresh powder, and that's definitely something I will need and use. I'm getting low on the powder I've been using, so that's really awesome. So far, I've been really happy with my Ipsy Glam bags and my Boxy Charms for both July and August. I feel like I'm like four out of five products on all of them. Like most of them are products that I'll be using. So I'm really excited for that. And that only just leaves the Glam Bag Pluses left. And they are currently holding up my computer, so I will be right back as I rearrange. Hang on. Okay, I'm back. I did one last rearrange. I'm back sitting on the cold floor, but at least it's cold. <laughs> Try not to slouch my shoulders too much here. And we're going to do our Ipsy Glam Bag Pluses. I am super excited for my pluses. I have no idea which one is which, so I'm just going to open them both right now. So far, every month, I think the Ipsy Plus has been my favorite subscription box, even though this these last two months I've been really happy with BoxyCharm, but I just have really loved Ipsy and their personalization especially, so I'm really excited to see what's in these guys. So, I just love their little sayings every time you open it too, you know, just you open it and it says, don't be pretty like them, be pretty like you. And it just makes me happy. <laughs> so, let's see what we have. Ooh, this is my July box. I opened them in the right order. Dive in, summer is in full swing. Let's soak it up with dewy skin, beach babe waves, and shimmering budge proof makeup looks. That's the same thing the other card said. Sorry. <laughs> All right. First in here. Perlise, I'm pretty sure it's Perlise. Watermelon Energizing Aqua Balm. Lightweight oil free gel cream. Refreshes and moisturizes. Ooh, is this for your face or your skin? Watermelon, though, that's a good summery flavor. I keep calling them flavors. But I think you all know I mean smells. Please don't be eating these products. Mmm. It smells like watermelon candy. That smells good. 
just get a little bit out of there. Ooh, and it is like a gel. It's very smooth. Mm. I'm excited for that. Let's see. I would like to know if it's for face or hands. It's for your face. Apply pea-sized dots on your forehead, nose, chin, and cheeks. Which is perfect, because even though I might kind of like it on my hands, I really need a new moisturizer for my face, so I'll give that a shot as well for that. Next, wow, this thing is huge. Moisture Balancing Cream. Moisturizes deeply for 24 hours. Okay, is this one for your hands? Right to your face and body. So it's for both. Mm, wow, this thing is huge. I mean, I know they send us full-size products, but I normally expect something like this versus that. So that's really exciting. These all have these little plasticky things on them, and they're so annoying. But I guess they do keep the product fresh, so that's something. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Doesn't smell too bad. It's got a nice, clean, fresh smell to it. It doesn't say that it has a smell. It almost smells like a baby, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. <laughs> I think babies smell good, so... Next here I have It so Superhero Mascara. I've received this before in my BoxyCharm though, not from Ipsy, so that's still not a duplicate from Ipsy. And I really like this mascara a lot. I really felt like it gave me some good volume in my eyelashes, so I'm really excited to use this again. And what is this? Pixie Skin Treats Glow Mist with Propolis and Argan, Argan oil. Hmm. Not a huge fan of face mist things. They always kind of weird me out. And I have dry skin, but I do sweat. So don't we all sweat? But anyways, <laughs> um, I'll have to, I'll maybe give this a try, but I don't know that I'll use it a ton because I don't need something to make me glow. I do naturally. <laughs> Okay, last thing from my July Ipsy. Ooh, Huda Beauty 3D Highlighter Palette. Let's see if I can get it out of here. Why is this open? Oh, here we go. Maybe. Yeah, it helps if you take the plastic off first before you try to open. Okay, it still doesn't want to come out. Anyone else have this issue? There we go. Hmm. So here's the palette. Wow. This thing is... I'm sorry, but that's kind of creepy. It's like see-through, but then it's a picture. Anyway. So... First, it says prep. Apply Capri as a base to smooth skin and apply amplify light reflecting pearls. That's that one. Then it says set. Dab Santorini from cheek to temple to set and bring out the pop. That's that one. Then it says to sculpt, apply Azores, Azores? under cheekbones to add dimension and shape. And then... Four is flush, sweet Ibiza on the apples of your cheeks for a healthy glow. I don't know how much I'll use this, but it definitely has more colors, more products to it than I've ever had with this kind of thing. Um, so I'd definitely be willing to give it a shot. I'm kind of excited. Maybe that foundation brush will be good for one of these since I probably won't be using it for my actual foundation. All right, I'm down to my last box today, and that is my August Ipsy Plus. So, let's see what we got. Sorry for the bombard today. 
it's kind of been crazy, like I mentioned. Oh, and there's the slouch. It hurts to sit up straight, keep your back. Posture is good. Everybody needs to work on their posture. August 2019, bear yourself. Oh, and they've got some stuff on self-love. That's cool. All right. Near August Dipsy Plus. Very first thing I'm pulling out of here is It Bye Bye Foundation Full Coverage Moisturizer. Interesting. SPF 50 Broad Spectrum Physical Sunscreen. This actually might be really good for me. Um, I'm not great about putting sunscreen on all the time, especially on my face, and so a foundation that has it built in is always good for me. Um, might be a little light for my tan skin, though. Come on. It's got this little applicator guy, and I'm trying to get it some little, just a little bit to come out. Probably going to get a big old squirt. Come on. Ha! Huh. Still got a pretty big squirt, but it could have been worse. It's not a bad color. I wonder if I can suck some of that. Nope. Okay, it's coming out. Okay, hang on. We're making a mess. I'm going to wipe this on this box. Sorry. Sad day. Well, it actually doesn't go too bad with my hand. We'll have to see what it looks like on my face, but it seems to blend in pretty good on my hand there. So I'm definitely willing to give that a shot. It's a pretty good size. Again, I know that Ipsy Plus is supposed to be full size, but still sometimes the full size stuff surprises me. Oh, here's another thing from Pearlies. Blue Lotus Daily Moisturizer, and this also has sunscreen in it. No white tint. Prep skin for makeup. Ooh, they're sending me all sorts of good stuff. I feel like my August stuff is definitely maybe winning out over my July a little bit, but I am really loving it all. Another one of these. Mmm, that smells really good, too. So from Pearlise, I got the watermelon and the blue lotus. Cool. I like that. Ooh. Ooh. Tarte Dream Big Amazonian Clay Palette. Yes. I love Tarte. I think I've told you that before. I love Tarte. They're my favorite. Currently, at least. Um, look how cute that is. I got it so much. Hang on. There you go. They've got great packaging normally. They've got great products. They're cruelty free. They've got a lot of vegan products. And they just always have really pretty colors. And a lot of their eyeshadow palettes smell like chocolate. This one does. And they always have these little mirrors that stay up. They just have great packaging all around. I love these colors in here. There we go. It's a really nice palette. I feel like that's one that I can use a lot because it's got like the neutral, the lighter and the darker neutrals. And then it also has that like pinkish and purple one in the middle there. So I'm really excited for those. And I just really love the packaging. And I think I have one more product in here. Ooh, more brushes. These are the Farah brushes. I've received Farah brushes before from Ipsy, but these ones are a lot prettier than any of the other ones I've received before. Gosh, they're sending all sorts of cool brushes these last two months. That's really exciting. And these look their shapes look a little different than the brushes I've received before, so that's cool too. Looks like this one is, it says an angled brow. And then this one is just called a pencil. And then we also have 
a mini tapered, a concealer, and a mini shading. Yeah, so these are different than the brushes I got from Farrah from Dipsy before. So that's really exciting. I'm going to keep growing my collection until I have them all. Okay, that was everything for my July and August Ipsy Glam Bag, Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, and BoxyCharm. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Let me know which was your favorites. I'm definitely leaning towards August being my favorite, maybe just because it's also my birthday month. Um, I'm super excited to start getting my boxes for September. I'm really hoping I get the Boxy Luxe. I may have also signed up for another big seasonal box, and I'm just really excited. So I will see you guys all next month, and I hope you have a great day. See you later.